Hello, this is Catherine and Tanya of Twin Flame Mystique 1111. And today we are going to give a reading for the um, zodiac sign of Scorpio. And this is a collective reading for Scorpio. So let's see what y'all are doing for the rest of the month. All right, so <clears throat> we're going to start off with the Wisdom of the Oracles. Or, I'm sorry, the Enchanted Map. I always get it confused with the other one. Yeah. So what came out is number 38, Heal the Ouch. Nice. And number 54, Encouragement. Oh. And look, this is very, well, this is, uh, that's an 11. Okay. Heal the Ouch, yeah. See, and that's also very telling. The number 11 is the number of ascension. So um, this is already saying that through, through self-love and through, self, um, through your self-awareness, then you can, you can heal. 54, that's a nine, encouragement. Those are endings. Um, you know, find your soul tribe. Through your soul tribe, you can work this out. You can get through it. You are never alone. Yeah, let's see what the... Yeah, so the heal the ouch was clarified by the Queen of Swords. Oh. Cut out what no longer serves you. And yeah. the for the encouragement card, you're going to receive encouragement from the divine, from the universe. The Excellent. realizations, epiphanies, just knowing that your angels are, are around. Yes. The Ace of Swords. Let's do a little read on healing the ouch. Um, saying forgiveness is the healer of the soul. Absolutely. And this is a time for great soothing of the heart, body, soul, and mind, as this card indicates that you're that healing will be uh, prevalent in your life now. And if you feel drawn to study the healing arts, you'll be successful in developing your natural capacity to restore others to wellness. So however the message may be that you're being called to change your behaviors in order to heal the earth. So perhaps you'll switch to a cruelty-free diet, eating less meat, or perhaps you'll pay more attention to how much water or electricity you use. You're asked to be conscious of your footprint on the sacred earth and all of life and to commit to the healing path. So the heal the ouch card may also be an indicator of old wounds and broken bonds being mended so reconciliations are possible now so let bygones be bygones wow so so we have we have to go through this Forgiving oh, yes, it, yes. Forgiving and learning, calling in your soulmate, and chemistry. So this is through the Romance Angel cards, uh, Doreen Virtue, Romance Angels, Forgiving and Learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. Wow. And this one. And as you do that, then you will be calling in your soulmate. That's what you're going to be attracting to you. So your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together. And here's the chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. Yeah, and that's also through the power, through the law of attraction. Absolutely. All right, so we got, for the crowning energy for Scorpio, we have the five of pentacles and the three of wands reversed. So something you were waiting on something that it didn't turn out as planned or it wasn't as mm. fruitful as planned <clears throat> so your challenge is going to be the king of wands so that's taking positive action forward is what will get you through this in the past you have the knight of wands and the empress oh. so you know there was something that was acted upon you know, some, some type of passionate or creative endeavor, mm -hmm. right? In the future, you have the Three of Cups and the Seven of Pentacles, so you're going to have a celebration. Aww. There's going to be a victory or a reunion. Um, you just have to be patient. Yes. Yeah, so and that's kind of, that's kind of like right now. your seeds. 
with the not just with twin flames um, and divine partners, but with the whole collective. You know, is it's a reorganization. Yes, absolutely. Of everybody, so everybody's having to go through karmic endings in order to be with their divine partners. Yes. So, you know, it's just a little more, a little more patience. Not even a lot. I don't. I don't see. Right. Because the works, you know, you've been doing the work, um, but um, you've got to realize it for that for that reason and so for the and for the final outcome we actually got something that flew out yeah it's <laughs> that, a read me okay so the eight of cups so very good you're going to be walking away from these eight cups that you no longer want that no longer serve you mm -hmm. and then you're going to go in search of your two cups which is your soulmate excellent cups. yeah Wow. So there's going to be like a, what do you call it? Like a timeout period, a resting period. Yes. You know, yes. And In order that for is this the to theme, happen. especially with this coronavirus, we're, we're, you know, spirits like, that's it. Y'all have been, um, you know, I've been waiting for y'all to do it on your own. And here you are. You're going to have to do it now. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Mm-hmm. And so... Then the Queen of Cups will be able to come in, wow. or that either that's your energy or that's the person that's coming in your person's True. energy. Yeah. There's just a lot going on behind the scenes right now. There that is. There's just I I mean there's just yeah. a lot going on behind the scenes right there now. There is and look Scorpio, don't drain yourself in trying to be in control and knowing everything because, you know it's. Because that is your energy. It With is. the emperor, that is your yeah, energy. Yeah, you're wanting it's to know everything. And that's that's draining to that. There's a lot that, like Tony said, is going on that you don't need to have your energy in. All right? You need to let go and let God, let the universe, source energy, spirit, um, you know, get you back on track. All right? It's, and get your person back on track. Exactly. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, um, get out of your way, Scorpio. Yep. So, Ar Archangel Michael says you're on the right path. Excellent. Excellent. It's just you have to move forward. Yeah. Action. You have the courage to express the unique loving colors of your soul. Wow. And wow. Let's see. Let's get a spirit animal. Yes. This is really, these energies are really harsh, though. It's, um... Right now. It's not like last month, but it's, you know, it, it, this is a different wave, though. There is, this is right. a different, this a is different, a different wave of the ribbon. That's yeah, right. Yeah, this is a different wave of even the collective mm -hmm. we um, channeled last month, I think. Mm -hmm. Is what it feels like. Oh. So, Dove... Spirit, Spirit number that is 21. Such a beautiful card. And it says, Be peace. Oh, wow. So, like, I think our, well, my best advice anyway is just mm -hmm. have patience because it's coming and it's coming. It's not like before, it's coming very quickly. Very. So, the sooner that you get out of your way, Scorpio, in trying to control things or know things just um that is the action yeah that's the action that will come in wow well all right um very good read scorpio I can already see a few of you that I know listening to this over again and again. <laughs> and that's all right. That's all right. Good for you. All right. Well, thank you for tuning in, Scorpio. Um, and we are going to uh, have our email address uh, down below so that you can uh, reach us for a private reading or session. Um, also, our PayPal information. And please like and subscribe. Yes. Thank you. Have a blessed day, Scorpio.